Have your dogs ever come in with things they've broken, like let's say a gardening hose? Well, this is what today's story is about. So if you would like to hear the story, then keep on watching. Hi everybody, it's Mina. Welcome back to my channel. Or if this is the very first video that you're seeing of me, then Welcome to my channel. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below if you didn't already. I post every day except for Tuesday and Friday afternoon sometimes. And today in this video, I'm going to tell you guys a pretty funny story that still makes me laugh today about how my dog Pearl came in to the house with the end of the gardening hose that she had ripped off. So this is a story about how one day my mom had the water running or was it, um, um, she was like watering one time and I think she dropped the ho the gardening hose for a second and then Pearl ripped off the head of the gardening hose cause she was chasing so much of the water that she just like ripped it off one day and came in the house with the other end of the gardening hose. So this is a story just to let you guys know Always be careful when your dog likes to play with water because they can rip a gardening hose. Those can be quite expensive. Luckily, we weren't, my mom wasn't mad about it, but she found it super funny that Pearl was able to rip off the end of the gardening hose. So I'm going to get started and I hope you guys enjoy this video and I hope it makes you laugh. So this all started about 18 years ago. This is when we first got Pearl. Um, so for those who are new to my channel and don't know who Pearl was, she was one of my Boston Terriers. I'm sure you guys, if you've been longtime subscribers, you all might remember who Pearl was. Um, well, she appeared on many of my old videos here on YouTube. Sadly, we had to put her to sleep in December of 2015 because she had a brain tumor and we couldn't save her. So, so um, she's been on my YouTube channel before. Some of you who are longtime subscribers since 2012, you might remember her. Some of you who are new subscribers don't know. So I thought I'd just throw that in there just in case you're new to my channel and you don't know who Pearl was. So this all started, I think one summer, this was when I finished the fifth grade. This was like when Pearl was maybe, Excuse me. I think Pearl was about 11 months old at the time and she was playing one day with my mom when my mom, she was playing with my mom one day while my mom was watering the plants on our back deck and she was doing all the watering in the backyard. And I think she had, um, <laughs> <laughs> left the gardening hose on and I think she left like a sprinkler on it I don't remember but then she went upstairs for a sec to go do some household chores with chores or something I don't remember but she was watering and she had the water on in the backyard and then a couple minutes later later we noticed Pearl coming into <laughs> the house carrying something in her mouth. And we're wondering, when my mom and I are curious to know, what does Pearl have in her mouth? And we look and we start to notice it was the end of our gardening hose. And Pearl attacked the gardening hose and ripped the head of the gardening hose off. Well, we were not mad, but mad, we probably would have been mad because the gardening hose are kind of expensive. And the Pearl had the gardening hose in her mouth. She carried it into the house and dropped it. And my mom and I were cracking up because we just didn't expect Pearl to rip the head of the gardening hose off. And we just found it super funny that she came in and she dropped it and then she starts to sit down and we all start to laugh at her and she's all looking cute. Like she, um, she was just looking all cute and stuff. Like she didn't know what she did that was wrong. I know some owners would probably get mad at their dogs for ripping the gardening hose 
the head of the gardening hose off their garden, garden <laughs> off the hose. But honestly, we just found it super funny. I don't know why we found it so funny, but we just did not expect her to do that. And we were all laughing and everything. So sadly, my mom ended up having to throw the gardening hose away, but we couldn't use it anymore because Pearl had ripped the gardening, the head of the gardening hose off. So so I think my mom and um, my stepdad at the time had to go buy a new gardening hose. So I think they, um, after they threw that one away, they had to, the next day they went out and bought a new gardening hose. And um, we kind of had to keep Pearl away from the gardening hose or we had to start closing her in while we were watering so she wouldn't rip off our gardening hose despite the fact it was quite funny. Funny and um, we just could not stop thinking about how funny it was was and it because it was something we just did not expect her to do so the moral of the story is if you have a puppy that's quite playful well and you are watering and your dog loves to play with the gardening hose um be a little bit careful because um some dogs will play so hard it'll rip the head of your gardening hose off and Gardening hose are quite expensive to replace, so um, sometimes it can be quite funny because you don't expect your dog to rip the head of the gardening hose off. At least we didn't expect it and it just happened. So just keep that in mind to be careful when you're watering or if you leave the hose where your dog could probably go and rip off the head of the gardening hose. It just like happen sometimes so just keep it away from your dog so it doesn't get ripped off and at least we weren't angry about it we just like laughed at it because we just didn't expect it so sometimes your dogs will do things that you may that should make you mad but you'll end up laughing at it later on so, laughing at it later on but it just depends on how you feel it's just we just th found it hilarious because pearl loves loved playing with water at the time and she loved to go swimming she loved to play fetch it was just like any time she would time someone would water she would attack the gardening hose we just did not expect her to rip the head off so just keep that in mind if you don't want your gardening hose ruined make sure you put it away properly so your dog doesn't get it. So those are, that was a story about how my dog, sorry, I had a text message. Dog, so my dog Pearl ripped off the head of the gardening hose. I hope you guys liked the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already. I post every day except for Tuesday and Friday afternoon sometimes, and I'll see you in another video soon. Bye.